Good afternoon, friends. My name is Dad Bedi from the Shukara School of Hospitality, and today we're going to talk about French wines, which happen to be one of the pioneer wines in our wine industry. France happens to be a country where the wine cultivation has been going on since various centuries, and people have incorporated wine as a major part of their day-to-day -day lifestyle. And we can say this that French wines have that prestige of being called as the best wines on the planet, and they also act as a benchmark for other countries in wine cultivation. In today's video, I'm going to introduce to you all French wines. Also, I'm going to talk about the famous five red wines from France, their regions, their grapes, the year in which they were made, their region, and then I would move on to the five famous white wines from France. So, wine is produced throughout France. France produces 50 to 60 million hectoliters per year, or we could say somewhere around 7 to 8 billion bottles. France happens to be one of the largest wine producers in the world, and in terms of wine rankings, it has been the numero uno country in wine making and the quality for various generations plus the wine laws that are followed in France have been incorporated by various other countries and they have also gone ahead and made similar wine laws which are used in France. French wines have a very long history. They go back to the 6th century BC. Many of the France regions are going back to the Roman times. Fines produced range from expensive wines which are sold internationally and to modest wines which are usually seen within France. On the right hand side of this picture you can see a beautifully created and maintained vineyard in France, Bordeaux district. So introducing French wines. Two concepts are central to French wines. One is the notion of terroir and second is Appletation de origine controlling system. Terrier happens to be the weather, the rainfall, the soil, the humidity which is required for harvesting and cultivation of grapes, which moves on and plays a major role in the wine making process. And second happens to be the AOC system, which stands out for the wine laws which are being followed in this country for various centuries. Apart from these central systems, which are in themselves very good quality oriented, France is also a source of various grape varieties which are now planted throughout the world and are used in new worldwide countries also. As well as the wine making practices and styles of wine have been adopted in other countries as well. So we can say this very clearly that France happens to be a country where people look up to in terms of wine cultivation from the harvesting of grapes to the grape production, to the wine making practic practices and the overall quality of the wines. So now I am going to talk about 5 famous red wines from France. The first one happens to be Chateau Latour Grand Win Poet. The winery happens to be Chateau Latour. The grape used is Cabernet Franc. The region for this wine happens to be Bordeaux and the municipality happens to be Poliel. The food pairing, it goes well with beef, it goes well with lamb, it goes well with deer, and it also goes very well with poultry. The year in which it was made happens to be the year 2000. The next wine that we have happens to be Chateau Lafitte Rothschild, which is again from the Polyac municipality. The winery happens to be Chateau Lafitte Rothschild. The grape happens to be Cabernet Sauvignon. The region has to be Bordeaux because it's a red wine. The food pairing goes well with beef, it goes well with lamb, it goes well with deer and also with poultry. The Vintage happens to be 1999. The older the wine, the finer the wine, the more expensive the wine is there. The next red wine that we have happens to be Chateau Margaux Grand Win. The winery happens to be Chateau Margaux. The grapes happen to be Merlot, Cabernet Sauvignon and Cabernet Franc which makes it a blended wine. 
region happens to be Bordeaux, the sub-region happens to be Madoc. It goes well with beef, lamb, deer and poultry. The vintage happens to be the year 2000. The next famous red wine that we have is Chateau Hotebrian, Pézard Lyonne. The winery happens to be Chateau Margaux. The grapes happen to be Merlot, Cabernet Sauvignon and Cabernet Franc. The region happens to be Bordeaux. It goes well with beef, lamb, deer and poultry. And the year happens to be 2009. The next wine we have is Chateau Limbais Polyac, which happens to be from the winery of Chateau Limbais. The grape happens to be Cabernet Sauvignon and Petit Vardo. The region happens to be Bordeaux and the sub region happens to be Madoc. The food pairing happens with beef, lamb, deer, and poultry, as always in the cases of red wines. And the vintage year happens to be 1959, a very old, expensive wine from this particular region. So moving on from red wines, we move on to five famous white wines. Joseph Drohe Margos de Lakshe. The winery happens to be Joseph Drohe. The grape happens to be Chardonnay. The region happens to be Burgundy. So we moved on from Bordeaux to Burgundy. Côte de Bion is the sub-region and the municipality happens to be Montreux Grand Cru. The food pairing happens to be with pasta, fish, sulfish, mild and soft cheese and cured meat. The year happens to be 2002. The next white wine that we have is Vincent Davasti, which is Les Frosé Sablis. The area happens to be Sablis, which is an area very famous for white wines. The grape used is Chardonnay. The main principal region is Burgundy. As white wines always go well with pork, fish, selfish, mild and soft cheese, the year happens to be 2013. The next white wine that we have happens to be Domaine Henry Boylaw, which is made from the grape Chardonnay. The region happens to be Burgundy, the sub-region has to be Bertar and it follows from the municipality of Grand Cru. It goes well with pasta, fish, shellfish, mild and soft cheese and cured meat. The year happens to be 2008. The fourth famous white wine from France happens to be Didier Dogneau Celeste which is made from Sauvignon Blanc. The region happens to be Loire Valley. It goes well with pork, selfish, spicy food, goat cheese and even vegetarian food items. The year happens to be 2008. The fifth and the final white wine which is famous for France happens to be Domaine Lavai Savillier which is made from the grape Chardonnay. The region happens to be Burgundy. It goes well with pasta, fish, shellfish, mild and soft cheese and cured meat. The year happens to be 2015. So I hope you liked my video. If you have any questions, you can always post them in the chat box. In the next video, we are going to talk about Indian wines. Thank you for your time. Have a nice day. Thank you.